Oh my God. I am at Creamhill Creamery in Hamilton, New York. What an awesome place this is. I've been wanting to come here for a long time. A friend of mine had picked up Creamhill chocolate milk months ago and brought it down to North Carolina. So I was able to try it down there. And I was like, as soon as it crossed my lips the first time, I was like, okay, next time I go to New York State, I'm going to Hamilton. And that's just the end of the story. So here we are, and I could not be happier. I've got an awesome little dairy store in there, lots of different products in there. We bought butter, we bought maple syrup, we bought cheese, we bought yogurt, uh, we bought chocolate milk, obviously. Uh, the chocolate milk does require shaking up its three ingredients. That's part of what I love about it. It's simple, but it captures the essence of exactly what chocolate milk should be. All chocolate milk should aspire to be something like this. Now, you can have awesome chocolate milks that have the, the carrageenan and, and the cornstarch and the vanilla and whatever else. It can taste awesome, it can still feel great. And, and plenty of the chocolate milks that I rate at 10 or nine and a half have that as an ingredient, it's just the way it is. But when something can nail it with so few ingredients, it's perfect and it's like, man, why do you have to add any other stuff to it? This is one of the very best chocolate milks I've had in the last couple of years. Uh, it's, 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 you know, people ask me, oh, what's your favorite chocolate milk? This one is one of those ones that comes to mind quickly. This has so much of what I'm looking for in a chocolate milk. It's got that thin, but ultimately creamy viscosity. It's got a bit of grassiness too. And there's some wildness in this, which I absolutely love. It adds dimensionality to the cream. It's indulgence in simplicity, I guess. Or there's like a, I don't know, there, there's something really attractive about simplicity and not just in milk, but in, in other things in life, right? You know, it's the simple things that tend to make us happy. And for me, you know, non-homogenized milk, cocoa and, uh, and sugar, that's what makes me happy in this form. I mean, nothing, nothing's better than this right now. So well done, Cream Hill. Hey, they had a little thing. Okay, they had my review. So they must've seen my review. They posted on the outside of the cooler. They didn't know I was coming. I'm a God. Posted my review. That is killer. I got this, this is an unmanned store, uh, so I got nobody to talk to. Uh, I've rarely seen my score posted at a place, only a couple of different places, and this was a surprise. So uh, I'm very fired up that they saw it and, and thought that it was meaningful enough and whatever. Um, so that's cool. Super fired up, and uh, the, the fridge is fully stocked. Amazing looking stuff. I'm gonna probably maybe buy every size of it if I got room for it in the cooler. Sadly, Bruce and, uh, and Nancy, neither of them are here right now to chat, but oh well. I I'd like to think I'll be back. It's a little bit tough to get to for me from where I usually go in New York, but I'll, I'll make my way out here at some point and uh, and then pick this stuff up again. So, hey, I can't say enough about Cream Hill Creamery. This, this chocolate milk is absolutely amazing. This is one of the very best that I've had uh, since I've been doing this in the last six years, so I love it. But for me, for a flavor, this has so much of what I look for in chocolate milk. It has bugs flying into my face. Okay, but this, oh man, I'm like a pig in shit up here. This is awesome. The chocolate milk is fully stocked. Uh, super excited. Oh, they can get a gallon of this stuff. Look at this. hot and bothered. <laughs>